I like English because it's so interesting, different and chic. It's very important in my life. It's a key for the future. Because it's important for my life, for my job and the school. There are more job opportunities. In my future, it's very important. I love English. <laughs> I love it and I want to be an English teacher. We're very excited about today. Uh, we're celebrating the Black History Month and we've been blessed with the help of two fantastic ladies, Yemi and Fazi, who are going to be introducing the kids to a little bit of black history and lots of fun in terms of movement and drums and happiness and everything black culture is all about. How are you today, guys? You happy to be here? Yes. yes. We have a fantastic session for you. We have the pleasure of having with us Fazi. 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 With them. Fazi. 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 And we have Yemi. 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 Today you're going to get really excited. You're going to get so excited, and I'm going to need to get your attention. So I'm going to say one word to you. I go, and you're going to say one word back to me. Ame. I go means attention. Ame means I'm listening. Is that a deal? Yes. Okay. I go. Ame. I go. Ame. Ame. I'm going to play my drum. While I'm playing my drum, you're going to dance around in the space. You can go, this is dancing. <laughs> this is dancing. <laughs> this is dancing. <laughs> if you're dancing and I call out a number, like one, you have to pose by yourself. If I say two, you have to get with one other person. <laughs> Today we're here in Limon, and it's a place I've been waiting to come to. And what we're going to do is share some of the African-American experience with these children here in Limon as part of the African-American History Year. I hope, number one, that the children will have fun. I hope, number two, they have a greater understanding of who I am. And so if they see other people like me, they will understand something of the, the history of people like me. They will also understand the connectedness of African people as well as the Caribbean people, and that we're all basically one people. Three! <laughs> Where am I from? Where's Jamie from? Maybe Africa. Huh? Maybe Africa. Am I black? Yeah. Am I black? No. No. Put it there. Ooh! Same, right? Same. Are you black? to be a celebration of Black History Month. We will introduce that aspect of African American culture to our ACCESS students. But in addition to that, we're also going to bridge a gap between maybe some historical gaps that may not be known between Costa Rica, Africa, and the Caribbean. 
And I would like the students to understand that there are some very common threads that we all share coming from African descent or from the Caribbean or from a Hispanic culture. So it's just a sharing of culture in general and we definitely want them to understand and appreciate Africa at, at its best. <laughs> touch it? You can lift it up. It looks the same in the inside as it does on the outside. You know how to tie dye? You know tie dye. No tie dye. Say no. You don't know tie dye? Good, because I'm about to show you tie dye. <laughs> this is indigo. Indigo. Yes, and it's blue color dye. Take your shirt. Yeah, it's been a great experience for them today. Uh, they were very happy, they were very moved uh, about the whole video um, that the girls showed. Also, it was a great experience for them to become more cultural sensitive towards other cultures and to learn that they come from, you know, African descendants. So I think it's very important for them to know about their roots, where they come from, and in terms of history and in terms of having a sense of belonging to their own culture, even though they're Costa Ricans. One time after me. <laughs> you're gonna say, I like you, you like me. And girls, you're gonna say, and I like you, you like me. I learned then a lot about <coughs> culture of Africa. I learned that we are all beautiful people beside the cultures. It's very important this experience on the course and everything because it helped me a lot because when I go to the university I would know pretty much about English. And I learn about Africa and I learn from my life that it's important to don't give up, to keep trying when I make a mistake. It's important because it's a practice of English and English of different cultures, not only from states of Africa and England and different parts of the world, and that's interesting. I think that they discover more about themselves and about their roots and uh, about their identity, and uh, that was amazing. I have not had an easy life myself, and so I understand these children. And by me being here, I can tell them it's possible for anybody to go anywhere and to do anything. All you have to do is work hard and believe it.